Welcome students to Dashwad International School. I am Abhilasha Shrivastava. Hope you are well. We hope that you and your family are taking necessary precaution towards health, hygiene, as well as suggesting others to follow the same. We hope for your well-being. Today we are going to start with English language. English language, when we need to communicate with each other or talk to each other, we need a language. And in that language, there are eight parts of speech. Namely, noun, pronoun, verb, adverb, adjective, conjunction, preposition and lastly interjection let's let's repeat it one more time there are eight part of speech when we talk or when we say anything we deliver it or we say it in the form of speech and that speech is classified in eight categories see eight parts namely noun pronoun Verb, adverb, adjective, conjunction, preposition, and lastly, interjection. These are eight parts of a speech. Today we are going to start with adverb. We are going to start with adverb. Children, today we are going to start with adverb. Let's spell adverb. A, D, V, E, R, B, S. Adverbs. This is adverbs. Moving ahead. Let's see what is adverb. Adverb. When we add ly 
to any adjective that means any quality adjective shows the quality it will become an adverb moving ahead let's see over here is a volume the volume is brave brave is the verb or this bravery is the and bravely is the adverb brave is the verb bravely is the adverb let's spell brave b r a v e e brave in hindi we call brave bahadur bravely let's spell bravely b r a v e l y that is bravely see it is a soldier here is a soldier he is very brave and he is showing he is fighting in a battle and he is fighting bravely ek soldier hai jo kahi ladai mein jo ladai kar raha hai aur ladai wahan pe kaise kar raha hai bahut bahaduri se kar raha hai that is he is fighting bravely moving ahead let's see some more example fortunate fortunate f o r t u n a t e fortunate here is a boy here is a fish a boy was swimming in a river and it's very fortunate he found or he saw a fish it was, he was very lucky fortunate means very lucky let's see the, the adverb of fortunate is fortunately f o r t u n a t e l y fortunately the boy met or saw the fish fortunately moving ahead heavy heavy the verb over here is heavy see there is a guy a boy is here he is doing some exercise in gym and he is pulling some weights see there are weights and it is very heavy right and he is working out heavy no he is working out heavily he is working out heavily let's uh, let's spell the word heavy h e a v y heavy heavily h e a v r e l y heavily he is working out heavily bahut zor bahut zyada zor se bahut zor laga kar ke ye workout kar raha hai ya fir exercise kar raha hai moving ahead now here is a joker he is doing his stunt and he is very joyful so he is performing his stunt joyfully joyful is the verb joyfully is the adverb let's spell joyful j o y f u l joyful let's spell joyfully j o y f u l l y joyful see the joker here is performing joyful moving ahead noisy bam zap pow see it's a noise that means the adverb of noisy is noisy and let's spell noisy n o i s y noisy let's spell noisily n o i s i l y the children are playing noisy are making a noise they are playing noisily bahut zyada shor macha rahe hain moving ahead let's see this example here is a cat it is making a soft noise it is purring when a cat makes soft noises it 
it is known as purring or purr p u r purr it is making some soft noise or we can say the cat is purring softly s o f t l y softly the cat is purring softly moving ahead now let's see this is a mountain climber see there are people who likes to for adventure they climb mountain mountain pe chadte hain see he is climbing on a mountain and with the using a rope with the help of some ropes at times he is climbing he should be very careful see the rope over here is a little bit torn now thodi si टूट रही है ना ही शुड बी केयरफुल उसको ध्यान देना चाहिए दैट मीन्स अ माउंटेन द माउंटेन क्लाइंबर शुड क्लाइम केयरफुली मतलब कि जो माउंटेन क्लाइंबर है उसको ध्यान दे करके चढ़ना चाहिए केयरफुल सी ए आर ई केयर एफ यू एल केयरफुल केयरफुली सी ए आर ई F U L L Y carefully. Moving ahead. Anxious. That means परेशान होना. The adverb of anxious is anxiously. Bitter. कड़वा. Bitter. Let's spell first. Let's spell anxious. A N X I O U S. anxious the pronunciation of this word is anxious let's spell this a n x i o u s l y anxiously bitter b i t t e r bitter or the adverb form of bitter is bitterly b i t t e r L Y bitterly. Bitter is kana. Brutal. What is this? Brutal. B R U T A L. Brutal. That means जो बिना दया के करता है, बिना दया ही, उसको दया नहीं आती, वो बहुत ही brutal है. Brutally. That verb of brutal is brutally. B R U T A L L Y brutally. Let's see one more time. Anxious, anxiously, bitter, bitterly, brutal, brutally. Moving ahead. Let's see some more. Careful, carefully, fearless. जिसको कोई भी डर ना फियरलेस फियर इज डर फियरलेस इज जिसको कोई भी डर ना एडवर्ब ऑफ फियरलेस फियरलेस इज फियरलेसली नो द एडवर्ब ऑफ नोबल इज नोबली एन ओ बी एल वाई नोबल मीन्स महान मूविंग है Underline those words which are not adverb. We are going to do a little exercise in which we have to underline the words who are which are not adverb. Actually, we have already underlined it. Let's see what. Softly, truly, may. In these three words, may is not adverb, right? See, L Y is there. First thing, first thing, notice to find any adverb. First, notice the L Y. L Y is not there. Therefore, it is not an adverb. Move ahead. Fearless, heavily, brutally. Again, the L Y is missing. L Y नहीं है ना? L Y नहीं है. That means it is not an adverb. Move ahead. Underline the verbs. Uh, underline the adverbs in the following sentence. 
now we have to underline the or we have to find the adverbs they will tell fiercely with golet golet is over here he is golet and he is david he dealt with him see golet is a giant bahut bada sa aadmi hai na aur david is a small person chota sa aadmi hai he dealt with us se jo hai nipta usse ladai kiya fearlessly bina dare dekho bina dare lad raha na he is fighting with the golet with without any fear fearlessly fearlessly over here this the adverb moving ahead jesus talk gently to the children see he is jesus jesus christ is there and he is talking to the children how he is talking he is talking very gently very politely very gently gently over here is the adverb moving ahead we must cross the road carefully two boys are here do ladke hain they are crossing the road they are about to cross the road they should cross it very carefully whenever and children and you also whenever you are crossing a road you should always mind the traffic rules हमेशा ट्रैफिक रूल्स को ध्यान दीजिए वेन एवर यू आर क्रॉसिंग अलोड ऑलवेज लुक लेफ्ट एंड राइट बोथ द साइड देन ओनली क्रॉस इफ दैट इज नो व्हीकल राइट व्हाट व्हाट दे आर डूइंग दे मस्ट क्रॉस द रोड केयरफुली वेन एवर दे आर गोइंग टू क्रॉस दे शुड क्रॉस केयरफुली ध्यान दे करके करना चाहिए मोवेड है द बॉयज इन द कार गो लाफिंग लाउडली See, there is a car, and there are some boys over here. And what are they doing? Laughing. How they are laughing? They are laughing loudly. वो कार में हैं, हँस रहे हैं. और कैसे हँस रहे हैं? तो जोर-जोर से हँस रहे हैं. They are laughing loudly. Moving ahead. Now, in a library, we should talk quietly. actually we should not talk in the library but if we it is very necessary to talk then we should talk very quietly let's spell the word library l i b r a r y library library is a place in your school where there is where there are lots of books jahan pe dher sari books rehti hain you can take out the book and you can read the stories or you can study from it and keep it back and there should be no noise wahan pe baat nahi karna chahiye if it is very necessary that you have to talk agar aapko bolna hi hai kuch jaise kuch puchna ho kuch karna ho then you should talk quietly bahut hi dheere bolenge aap bahut dheere dheere moving ahead Sharon sew skillfully. There is a girl whose name is Sharon, and she is sewing. Sewing means kapda sil rahi hai. See, there is a sewing machine, and she is stitching some clothes. Some clothes, right? When she is stitching some clothes, the the way she is stitching is very skillful. बहुत अच्छे से कर रही है. कारीगर की तरह कर रही है जिसमें कोई भी गलती ना हो दैट इज स्किलफुल और शी सुई शी शैल इज क्यू स्किलफुल मूविंग अहेड फ्रॉम एडवर्ब्स फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग फॉर्म एडवर्ब्स फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग यू हैव टू मेक एडवर्ब्स फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग वर्ड्स स्लो द वर्ड स्लो विल बिकम Slowly. This is a tortoise or turtle. The turtle walks very slowly. Slow. He is very slow, and when he walks, he walks very slowly. 
بوجود لهن clear will become clearly clear will become clearly greedy that means lalchi greedy see the boy is greedy lalchi hai na bachcha jaldi se bread kha raha hai na he is greedy he is the boy is eating the bread greedily wo bahut lalch se bhara hai lalchi jaise jo hai kha raha hai wo jaldi se see greedily he is having the bread greedily moving ahead quick will become quickly the fireman ran quickly to put out the fire this is a fireman ye fireman hai na ye fireman jo hai bahut jaldi se daud ke gaya taki wo aag bujha sake he can put out the fire he ran quickly moving ahead careful will become carefully happy will become The girl is standing, a smiling, happy. वो बहुत खुशी से हंस रही है, मुस्कुरा रही है. See, happy. She, she is smiling or not? This concludes our first session of English language. Hope you learn something new every day. We wish for your well-being. Stay home, stay safe, be well. Thank you. This concludes our first session of English language. Hope you learn something new every day. We wish for your well-being. Stay home, stay safe, be well. Thank you.